Let's start with you, Michael. Tell us about your flag-inspired dress. My flag was Greece. I was inspired definitely, of course, by the colors and the culture because I myself am Greek. You see, I'm on the fence about this dress. I mean, it's a very acceptable dress, but it's just screaming beauty pageant to me right now. I think it's the heaviness of the velvet in the bow with the draping is sort of a little confusing. There's something a little regal. When I think of Greece, I think of the light colors. I'm not thinking of heavy velvets. You have the same feeling that uh, Georgina had. The starting point of draping is there in the dress. However, it has been treated with a lot of volume, maybe too much heaviness. At the same time, I didn't expect so much uh, crystal. The one thing I didn't like about the dress is the drape that goes around the side. I felt that made for a number of awkward angles. And then the kind of turnaround again, I'm sorry, the kind of, the, I find like a little bit desperation of the cutting it so low on the side to come away from the drape. You know what I mean? It's like you're trying too many things at once. It's very risky on the back there. <laughs> I think maybe you could have, yeah, ga gained an inch or two. The only thing that really, really bothers me about this dress is that blue bow. I didn't want to just leave it as this big blue ribbon that looks like I just stuck it there to throw the two colors together. Oh, here you go, it matches the flag, you know? But it does, it looks yeah. that way because, the, you, because of the trim. It would have with, looked way better without the trim. I like the trim around the neckline. I don't like the trim that you, it looks like you stuck the trim on the bow to me. That alone would have taken the beauty pageant element away.